Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday I posted that Windows 11 version 23H2 deprecates three more features, debloating Windows further. Now I'll leave that video down below, but just to tie it into today's video, um, as mentioned, Microsoft is working to try and manage the overall size of Windows by removing a certain apps and features. And already we have seen apps like Cortana um, being deprecated. WordPad is soon to be um, uh, deprecated. And in the Insider program, uh, the Maps and Movies and TV apps are also being deprecated. So although Microsoft is working um, on trying to debloat Windows uh, 11, as you have seen from the title of this video, uh, Windows 11's, uh, the 23H2 ISO, is the largest ever. And I just thought we could do a couple of quick comparisons today, just to do a comparison as to how uh, these ISO image files have incrementally got larger over time. Now, as many of you will know, um, you can download Windows 11, the annual feature update version 23H2 from Microsoft's website. And obviously, one of those options is the ISO disk image. Now, I took this screenshot yesterday, downloading um, Windows uh, 11 23H2's ISO image file. And here we can see it's 6.2 gigabytes, 6.24 to be um, exact, which, um, as mentioned, is quite large compared to previous versions. Now, just to give you a bit of a comparison, the creator's update for Windows 10 back in the day, version 1703 was less than four gigabytes then with the uh, 22h2 feature update for windows 10 uh, back in october november of uh, 2022 it jumped from four gigabytes to 5.8 gigabytes and then moving on to windows 11 the original release of windows 11 version 21h2 was very close to Windows 10 version 22H2 coming in at 5.7 gigabytes. And then uh, Windows 11 22H2, last year's feature update, rolled in at 5.8, which they put it exactly the same as version 22H2 of Windows 10. And then as mentioned, Windows 11 version 23H2 is now sitting at 6.24 gigabytes. So the largest an ISO has ever been for Windows as um, far as recent memory um, takes me, so to speak. Now, a reason for this is because, obviously, um, there's a whole lot of new features that have been made available in Windows 11. And obviously, with new features, it increases the size of Windows and the ISO file, um, as an example. And as mentioned with Moment 4, which will be included by default in 23H2 if you didn't install the Moment 4 feature update, Moment 4 includes 150 new features. So that's a lot of um, new features. So obviously that's a reason that can explain why the ISO for Windows 11 version 23H2 is the largest it's ever been. And just wanted to put it out there and uh, um, just a bit of a fun kind of fact regarding the ISO image files. And we can see why Microsoft is working on trying to debloat Windows, as mentioned. We're already um, in 23H2, they've deprecated three services, and there are a couple of other features that will be deprecated soon, as I've been posting in Windows. So just putting it out there just to keep you posted and in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.